I have some relationship with uh, this question uh, as, a, as, a, as a skin in the game function. So let me first of all start with classifying the kind of content that um, the generative AI, uh, uh, you know, related technology is going to have an impact on. Number one, short form text content. Second is long form text content. The third one is long form visual uh, visual content. The fourth one is short form visual content. And by this time you would have all figured out what I mean by this. And as of now, as we speak today, the short form text content and the long form text content, based on my personal assessment, LLMs and Generative AI, they have done a phenomenal job in terms of uh, you know, giving us value, immediate value, I can say that for sure. And based on the uh, you know, value creation that they have done, rather than pointing out the industries first, I would probably say uh, who would be the ones who would be helped, people who do copywriting, marketing in general, they seem to get phenomenal value out of this at this point in time. The second one is even people who do technical documentation, they can put the current uh, you know, advancements that we have uh, in LLMs and generative AI to use to do the review and also argument content. The third one, I, th I have also seen quite surprisingly the MRO space finding value in it. So um, that's on the way the text content is getting argumented by generative AI. When we come to short form and long form visual content, and what I mean by that is images and you know video shots and probably movies. There seems to be not much of a progress, at least at this uh, juncture. But we can expect significant amount of uh, uh, changes to happen in terms of how visual content is going to uh, uh, be impacted too. So, so to summarize, uh, you know, my answer in terms of where we can expect content generation uh, related argumentation to be done by generative AI. If I have to give you some idea in terms of the verticals or the markets where we can expect improvements or value creation or addition, it, it would be in publishing, education, marketing, and also in MRO. I'm not sure how entertainment will get impacted in the short term, but we can expect some level of disruption to happen uh, once when the generative AI kind of finds out it's its second win with respect to generating video and um, images like how it does a phenomenal job with text. That's my take in terms of how things are going to be uh, with respect to content creation and generative AI. Let's wait and watch.